came once and they said to me, Garrity, you don't like rich people. You think that there are too many of them. And I said, no, I think there are too few. Yes. <laughs> it would be fine with me if everybody was rich. Okay. <laughs> uh, but no, seriously. Um, and a more serious response to your question. One of the problems for me, and this may be a disturbing comment to much of the audience, uh, my view is that the compassion that's expressed by Obama is not supported by a policy agenda that has the substantive effects of addressing the huge amount of joblessness the rising poverty rate in the U.S. The U.S. economy now has the highest poverty rate since the war on poverty was initiated in the mid-1960s. Okay. And, uh, and that growth in poverty exploded even after George Bush's term as president. And this is not a subject for conversation in the U.S. on the U.S. political scene. We hear nothing about it. We heard nothing about it during the course of the election. So I'm, I'm not certain that there is this substantive difference in terms of the policy outcomes that will be pursued under the second Obama administration from the Romney administration. I'm, I'm kind of reminded of uh, a very cynical comment that W.E.B. Du Bois made in 1956 when he said he was not going to vote for the presidency. This was also confused with the notion that he wasn't going to vote at all, but he said he wasn't going to vote for either of the presidential candidates. He said, uh, there are no two evils. There's only one evil, but it has two different names. <laughs> The source countries for Barbados include, in particular, the United Kingdom and the United States. And between January to August, in the interval 2011 through 2012, in that same span of months in each of the years, there was a 6.8% drop in tourist arrivals from the United States and a 10% drop in tourist arrivals from the UK. Overall, there was a 4.8% drop in total arrivals during the same interval, a 2.1% decline in cruise passengers, and a 10% decline in cruise calls. The significance of the tourist sector can be dramatized by the fact that in any given year, the total number of tourist arrivals typically constitute at least 150% of the total Asian population. Therefore, we have a mechanism that resembles the older process, where there is a transmission of business cycle swings from north to south that still influences the performance of the Barbadian economy.